Uncle. Oh, Spencer. Spencer. What are you doing, here? boy? I was, uh, I was just hoping to give Lisa my condolences, but I'm too late. Well, it was a nice memorial. I'm sure that Britt would have approved. Lisa will no doubt be struck by the irony of the situation. What irony is that? That she and I are living in the same hell. The hell of losing one's only living child. Uncle, did something happen to Valentine? He died. My God. How? Drowned. In Paris. I don't understand. How? He drowned. What was he doing there? Was he on business? My son died, putting others ahead of his family. Let that be a lesson to you, Spencer. Friends may have their appeal. Women may, may have their uses. But in the final analysis, cleave only to your true family. Only a Cassidyne can really understand another Cassidyne. Heed these words, Spencer. Lest you suffer the same fate as my son. Promise me you are committed to this family, Spencer. And to the future I'm trying to build for generations of Cassidy to come. I am. Um, I believe that there is a brighter future for the Cassidy line. That gives me great comfort. I knew I could count on you to do what's necessary. Oh, you can. Starting with taking full custody of my little brother or sister. Diane agreed to be my counsel. Even Ava offered to help. I have the support of my friends. Wait, you're, you're making this move against your father now? After everything I said about putting others ahead of family? Yes, Uncle, I heard the cleaving part, but my sibling is a Cassidyne too, arguably the only one worth saving. This baby represents the future that you are so passionate about. And shouldn't we give the newest Cassidyne heir the best chance in life? Can you honestly say that that would be with my father? Or Esme? Nicholas is desperate to raise this child. I don't care what my father wants. Oh. Neither do I. I knew I was right to put my trust in you, Spencer. Well played. This custody move is a stroke of genius. Well, I have to admit that I'm surprised you approve of me seeking custody, although I'm glad that you do. Well, how could I not? Oh, I don't just approve. I am impressed, Spencer. That this is a masterful move. It could be the key to finally getting your father to fall in line. Then you misunderstand, because this isn't about getting my father to fall in line. This is about getting him out of our lives. Isn't that what you want, too? Aren't you finished with him? Oh. No one's ever really finished with family. No, this is, uh, this move is seamless. It builds on everything already in motion. It'll take Nicholas losing everything, including his baby, to force him finally back into the fold. Uncle Victor, there has been enough manipulation in this family. This is a baby. This isn't leverage. Oh, come on, Spencer. Everything's leverage used in the right way. Well, my gaining custody of my sibling serves a higher purpose. It is to save my little brother or sister from my father. Now, you keep telling yourself that as long as you like. But from where I'm standing, I'm seeing a man finally tapping into his natural-born instincts. You know, before I saw you, Spencer, I was really quite bereft. Now, thanks to you, I have hope again. <laughs>